a lot of the technology that exists today, it was science fiction yesterday. Technology is kind of fading away. It's going to be part of your everyday life. If we look maybe 30 years later, <laughs> is that technology and, uh, and, and, and human being actually uh, at some point converging. I think the experiences that we're going to have in the future are, are just going to be incredible and they're just going to be so interwoven with technology. It will be an incredibly integral part of our lives um, and, and all the technology will be just focused around how humans are using it. I think tomorrow uh, we have the chance to really digitalize anything. The computers start going from being smaller and on the outside to being smaller and integrated with us on the inside. And what does that allow? It's the combination of things like quantum computing, right? That we're going to have compute processing power uh, beyond what we could imagine. Uh, artificial intelligence, right? All the assistants, not necessarily to replace us, but to augment, right? To make us smarter, to, to help do all the things that we don't want to do. It's coming. It's here. But the real question is how far are we willing to take it and what are we going to do about it? So biotech is definitely going to be one of those big things. I am very excited to see what the next generation brings. For 30 years is a really long time in technology. One word, quantum, right? It is exciting because you know what? It is the future and it's happening now. We are on the first step of a big ladder towards the next generation of computing. It's going to rewrite how we build systems. It's going to rewrite everything we assume about what a computer can do and of course, Everyone knows it's going to change cryptography and security, but I think it's so exciting because we can see this next wave coming and we're actually doing real world projects today, which tells us it's all real and possible. And I couldn't be more excited about it. What we see in the future is that uh, more and more companies are working together and forming a large ecosystem. So technology around building the ecosystem from the platform play to cybersecurity in terms of how companies are interacting with each other to blockchain in terms of how, how contracting works and to overall how I get the workforce in a gig economy works. So forming that ecosystem is actually sort of very critical and very transformative to the business in the next 10 years.